Hey Raw Stars and welcome to this week's episode of Tiffany Talks. I am so excited. I am here at Lincoln Middle School for the performance of LA Dance Fit. And let me tell you, I teach at LA Dance Fit and my kids take class at LA Dance Fit, but that's not the most exciting thing about this performance. This performance is about the whole family. That's right, the whole family is gonna get involved here. It's not just going out to watch your kids, it's showing your kids how to live a fit, fierce, and fabulous life. The moms are performing on stage and it is gonna be bombed Com. And you know, I'm super supportive about mothers stepping out and leading by example and being sexy and strong because that's what your kids want. They want a mother that's that's um, vibrant and full of life and can go to the park and can hang out and do all these wonderful things with them. So you guys, check out this show. It's going to be just incredible and you're going to see what happens when people come together just to have fun and dance. these students are you know just casual dancers they're like from all walks of life but this is their chance to show their friends and family just how how far they've come and taking their dance to another I mean, the higher level you know and that's one of the reasons why I wanted to bring this to Tiffany talks because it is so important it's so important that you like stop don't stop living when you're a kid you got to still have fun as an adult and you show your kid what it means to really be fit fierce and fabulous what it really means to be active to continue to dance that's what it that's what it was when we're little we get a chance to go to dance school or or take some activity and right. then and then you have a, a demonstration a recital a performance right. right but as adults we're taking all these classes but we don't we you know we want to take if the students an opportunity to show where they how far they've how come. We don't fight for the whole body, but we respect everybody. And we back at everybody. So we don't fight for anybody. Don't worry about that.
can tell you the class, just getting near the class, you're going to feel the heat. Yeah. <laughs> just walking in the door, you feel the heat. She's so, so amazing. So tell us, like, what did you, what made you want to do these dance scenes, early dance day? I am Jamaican and luckily, and I love to, to share my culture and just and see people enjoy music and have a good time. Jamaica's really big on dancing. What do you feel like when you're on stage? I feel awesome. You feel awesome? Yeah, I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm meant right here to be there. Yes, you're meant to be there. And so, like, what? Who's, who do you admire? Who is one of your favorite dancers? Well, I guess who you should think about and who you are is yourself. You don't have to like say that's the best dancer because that will hurt the other people. So I would say other people are my favorite dancers. Oh, that's good. All right, well, thank you. You're going to do a great job on stage? Yes. it every day every day that I come to the studio and get to you know just feel their love first of all the little hugs the yes. hugs around the waist is like the best thing and then just their eagerness to learn and just the fact that they even though they are little they're young but they still focus and they still pay attention and they want to they want to make themselves happy and proud and you can tell they want to make me proud and that just brings my heart just so warm to see their willingness to to do what they can, you know, being and that they One are. of the things I love at the end of every class, she does this cool handshake. Can you show me how we can do of course. one of handshakes? How do you do it? Okay, now it is this top secret, right, but we can keep, we it. Know keep right. it under wraps. Okay. okay, so it's one, and then you gotta cross the other. Now you gotta give them elbows up, uh -huh. hit them, uh -huh. boom, hit it one time, turn it, what? and then seal the deal. Bam. Yes, yes. And I can <laughs> all my four year olds They know all it. come up with their handshake with her, but what does that teach them? Coordination, connection, energy, support. So, this is all the things that your young kids can learn from dance, and especially with these awesome teachers like Miss Ty at LA Dance Kids. <laughs> Okay, so I have an awesome performance coming up for you guys with this great, great, awesome team that are students of Kia, uh, Kiari, Kiki. What's your name? Cash. Cash. Molly. Molly. Elsie. Elsie. Jada. Jada. Destin. Sienna. Des what, Destin? Yes. Yes, and Sienna. And Sienna. Yeah. Are you guys ready to rock and roll? Yeah. Let me see. Yeah. 
with Belinda. She uh, not only works at LA Dance Bit and keeps everything together, but she has two beautiful daughters here and she is performing herself. So I want to tell you one thing. What does it mean to your daughters to see you like performing in a show like this? Well, it encourages them to continue in this passion of dance that they have mm -hmm. and seeing their own, you know, parent parents in a show. It makes them see that they as well can do it and it's fun that you know we can do a show together and it's fun for me too. And so what made you decide to do the show? Oh I love dancing too uh -huh. and in my back in the days I wanted to be a, a professional dancer and now that I have the chance to at least do it for fun and do it on the side I'm just so grateful and it's exciting. Yeah, yeah it's <laughs> awesome because what are the chances that you get to perform on the same stage with your little ones right? Exactly. This is what makes it so great so all of you moms out there that are thinking about doing something like that do it. Get involved with something. Yes. Show your kids. Like, you know, like it, it's not over after you do your dance recitals as a young kid. It doesn't matter, like, you know, if you're a professional dancer, if you had any dance background. But the fact that they're doing this show for everybody to come out and show their stuff is just awesome. You guys are going to love it. So yes. thank you, Belinda. We'll you. check her out Bye. on stage. Yes. Okay. Sometimes I don't even have counts for them. I just go da 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 da. Yeah, da, I know. Da, da, da. <laughs> it's a feel. Yeah, for it is me. a feeling. It is yes, a feel that's for the same me. way. One hundred percent. And so if I make them feel comfortable, I think the teacher, that's the teacher's job to make the students feel comfortable in that way. When you take away all the technical stuff and yeah. just focus on so like they can the really feel. move from their yes. souls. Yeah, it's the like, hip and when all When people that. first start learning how to dance, it's never like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Never. Yes. Right? They learn to feel with the music. So let's get like a cute little sexy move from you. Oh, send off. Let me see. Let me see. Something. Here we go. Uh -huh. We do this little move. Oh, Here, I'll have you hold we, we do that with the phone. Yeah, that's it. Yes. Hey. Very surprised. Okay. It's because I have a very sick husband and I had to have a place to go. This is it. No, this oh. is awesome. This is incredible. Yes, talk to us more about that. Talk to some other people who would really like to hear about what motivates you to get out and take care of yourself, even though you're a caretaker. That's all true. But it is the inner energy that we've got to put in a positive direction. Yes. And that's really what it's about. Well, she said something that I really want to kind of go back to. You got into dance because you needed a place to go because your husband is ill. You cannot take care of others unless you fill up your own cup. Absolutely. Okay? I totally agree. And, yeah. and the thing is, is that if you want to motivate your husband, when you come home looking good and feeling good, that would give me some energy, right? That would give anybody some energy. If, look, if you came home to my husband, he'd get well so fast. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I'm telling you, you are enough. You are so hot. Can you give us a little move, a little hip shake? Yes. All right. Okay, so I can't wait to see you on our stage. Okay. All right. Thank you guys so much. All thank right. you. Bye, Carol. Bye. Nice. Good luck. Break a leg. Oh, yeah. <laughs>
Rachel and Lillian, and they are both performing. So they're going to tell us what what team are you on, Rachel? Ryan's hands team. Ryan's hands team. Thank you. Same. Same. We're they're together. both dancing for Ryan. I think we have three people here. Who else is here? Me today. <laughs> <laughs> Sisters in it. Oh, okay, sister's your sister's in it. Yeah. Okay. All right. So, tell me what made you guys decide to get involved in dance. So, I normally would have never done dance team, <laughs> but our teacher's leaving, so I wanted to do dance team. And then, but I love it because you have so much fun, and you meet great people, and um, I think I might do it again. Yes, <laughs> we yes. love dance team. And what's the most? What's the something that you've really learned about yourself from performing? Um. That I can't make facial expressions very well. <laughs> exactly. Well, it's getting out of right your here. shell. Yes. Exactly. Doing something different. Exactly. So tell me, like, do you have, either of you have kids? I have two. Uh -huh. and you, I have one right that's here. What I I mean. That's what I meant by three people. But I was like, wait a minute. Did I make a mistake? Let me just cut that. If she's not pregnant, I'm not going to say anything. Yeah, you're right. Yes. But yeah, that's why so I'm going to do it. Thank you. Okay. Woo. I started sweating. I was like, oh my God, she's not pregnant. She is pregnant. So tell me, mommy. Absolutely, six and, months and good. <laughs> yes, and babies love happy mothers, and children love happy parents. So that's one of the reasons why we do these recitals Absolutely. as the dance teams, yep. because you can set an example for your children, for your grandchildren, that you should always take care of yourself and have some fun. Right? Agreed. All right, so we can't yes. wait to oh, see yes. you guys. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, we'll see you. Thank you so much. Awesome. Thanks, guys. Yes. Thank you. <laughs>
Podcast Stars. That was an incredible show. I'm so inspired. I hope you guys got inspired too. And what I want you guys to take from this show is if you want to make a change, look at the man or the woman in the mirror and make that change because you, you only, you alone can make a difference in your life and everyone's around you. So thank you guys for watching. Remember, we are celebrating LA Dance Fit. We're celebrating families coming together as a community. We are celebrating happiness. I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.